Hey guys, what's going on? I'm Eric Surf6, and today I'm being joined by Mega Brain 6100. The infamous Mega Brain 6100. Welcome to the show. Today we've got something really special. We've got a new batch of MREs. I bought two cases. In the first case is menu items number 1 to 12, and in the second case is menu items number 13 to 24. So what we're going to do each week, we're going to have one each. So we're doing one and two for this, this one. I'll have number one, you have number two, and then we'll, uh, we'll switch off, try each other's. But So this one, menu number one is chili with beans. Oh, I love chili. Haven't had chili in ages. What do you got? Mine's beef shredded and barbecue sauce. Beef shredded in barbecue sauce. That sounds good. Let's trade. No. No. <laughs> okay, so do you have a knife? I, I, I used to have a knife. No knife. Okay, and we got water for the drinks and for the heating elements that are inside here. So rip into them. Let's go. Let's do this. See who can get theirs open first using their bare hands. No teeth. <laughs> How'd you do that, man? Do that. Did you get a thumb in there or something? Yeah. Houston, we have a problem. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah, I see. So you go right to the, the military thought this out. You go right to the very center and you can get in. Mm -hmm. I'll try to remember that for future MREs, meals ready to eat. Yep, all right, just pour it all out. It's heavy. Oh, it's a bag inside of a bag. Interesting. Good packing, US military. Okay, and we're gonna use, did you see how he used this for trash right away? Mm-hmm, that's a good idea. Because you wind up, it winds up being a big mess Yeah. if you don't take care of your trash. There's a lot of packaging stuff, Yeah. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna do is get the heating element, the bag, the big bag, the big bang. It's this one. Maybe you have to use that. This is hot beverage bag. Oh, here it is. Okay, so it says MRE heater, United States. Yeah, I'm gonna pour water in these bad boys. And then we're gonna heat up our main meals. We could also heat up the, the hot beverage bag. Let's let's do this together. Did you get a hot beverage bag too? I'm gonna to do mine together at the same time. It says open fill with water to the appropriate fill line. Remove air from the bag, then close. You heat it four to six minutes. The one I have is it's a lemon lime. Beverage base powder, lemon lime, natural and artificial flavors. You got the orange one. Yeah. Oh, that's good, we got two different ones. Okay. How do you get it open? Just like that. Wait, this is not a hot beverage, this is a cold beverage. <laughs> Hang on a second. <laughs> we don't want lemon lime hot drink. We don't want orange hot drink. Just hang on to that for a second. Let's look a little deeper here. This should be like a coffee or something. Cheddar cheese, cheese spread, a vegetable cracker. Huh. I'm not seeing it. Maybe it's in here? I don't think so. Coffee? Oh, you're right. Yeah. He's a genius, ladies and gentlemen. That's why they call him Mega Brain. Could it be? Coffee instant type. Freeze dried. Okay, well, that can go in after. Let's just heat the water. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Let's do that when it's in a cup. So you have to decide like how much water you want to have, how much coffee. I'm just going to go for like this much, which is what, eight ounces probably? You want to do the same? Yeah. Okay, and this is going to go into the heating element. 
So good. Pour yourself some as well. And get this party started. Yeah, so that, that's the thing. You want to get the heating element started right away. Okay, all the air comes out. Oh, some water came out too. <laughs> Have a look at the heating element. This is the magic right here. This is what they look like. Huh? It's got a US patent. <laughs> yep, number 5,611,329. Uh-huh. Patent is licensed to looks for Magtech Incorporated. Oh, there it is. Okay. Okay, so you don't have to put much. The trick is, you got to get just a tiny bit of water, and then you you got to displace it, shake it up. So here goes. It's just a little bit. Do not overfill. I just overfilled it. <laughs> it's amazing. Still overfilled. That's just right. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do to get it equally displaced. That should start the heater. Yeah. It's still over. It's, it really doesn't take much water to start this thing. Just a bit. Okay, and make sure you find your main course. That's, is that it? Yep. Chili with beans into the package. Yep. And then I guess you just let it sit. Okay, we're gonna need this water here. Just let it sit. For how many minutes does it say? Like 10 minutes. About 10 minutes, I yeah. think. Yeah. We'll see. Let's see if it says. Yeah, it's getting hot already. Yeah, this is genius, man. These things are really cool. Did you say how much time? Mm, doesn't say. Doesn't say. Maybe 10 minutes. Maybe 15. Yeah, we'll just start eating the rest of the stuff first. Yeah. Seems like it's heating up. Yeah, all right. Just let it cook. Just put it right there. Should we put the hot beverage bag in too? Oops. The hot beverage bag is also going in. We're getting things already. <laughs> Put that on the other, make sure you put it on the other side of the heating pad, right? Yeah. So that it, heating pad should be in the middle. Should put this in first. Yeah. Tricky, tricky. Ooh, hot, hot, hot. It's a bit of work getting it just right, huh? Yeah. It's only a bit of work. Ow! <laughs> Jeez. It's really heating up. It's really heating up quick. Uh -huh. It's tricky, huh? Maybe, maybe not, huh? Yeah. What do you think, guys? Is that too much stuff in the bag? It's too much stuff. It's too much stuff, he says. Okay. Hot water, cold water coming out. Yeah. Okay, so we're learning. We're learning. Yeah, it is better. It's just the main meal. And then what you do when the meal comes out, then you put the hot beverage in. So let's try to remember to do that. Okay. 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 
That's good. One more time. That water displaced. Okay. So I'm starving. Let's let's eat. Yeah. <laughs> I wish there was a nice green salad, but these are MREs. It's not gonna happen. I'm gonna do my beverage first, I think. So it's lemon lime. You got yours ready too? Let's pour them in together, see if we get the colors going. Ready? You yeah. with me? Here it goes. Oh yeah. Ooh. Lemon, lime drink, and orange. And locate the spoon. Mm-hmm. And see if we can stir these up and get the powder to liquefy. Yeah? No? No. <laughs> it's tricky, isn't it? Keep stirring. Slowly, it's working. Yeah. It doesn't dissolve right away, you gotta work it. It'd probably be better if there was more, lit, you know, more water. Yeah. But. Yeah, it's gonna be gooey on the bottom, but yeah, you know, it's all good. Okay, here goes. Oh my. That is really good. Mmm. It's super, super strong, but I like it. Tread? Yeah. How's yours? It's Same? thick, yeah. Thick. Yeah, needs more water for sure. But we have to ration the water because we're saving it, right, for the hot coffee at the end, right? Yeah. It's the first time we're going to be doing the coffee. Yeah, I like the lemon lime better. Which do you prefer? Lemon lime? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Too bad. <laughs> okay, so... What are you gonna start with? I'm gonna start with some crackers. Vegetable crackers with cheese spread. Now, vegetable crackers, cheese spread. You? Cranberries. Cranberries. How's that work? I'll dress one of these up for you. Cranberries. You just eat them like yeah. they are, or? Just eat them? I don't know, or you have to put water? Oh, the freeze dried. Yeah, like yeah, dried, dried just, fruits. Yeah, you just should probably it. just eat them, right? Okay, go for it. I like cranberries. Mm. And I like cheese and crackers. It's good. It's good, he says, huh? Oh, here. Welcome to the kitchen here. Look at that, huh? that goodness. Oh boy. Do the same for this one. That's a lot of cheese. That's a lot of cheese. Well, I hope you like cheese because I just put a whole bunch on. Cheese cracker sandwiches. Okay. One, two, and there's another cracker. So we can make sandwiches, that's kind of cool, right? Yeah. Okay, here you go. It's one for you. I'll show you, show you what I did here, so. That, and then that. Ooh, get that cheesy goodness, smush. Going in. Vegetable cracker with cheese. Hmm. Pretty good. It's a good cracker. Mm -hmm. Cheese is really good. Yeah. It's thick. And the cracker's got some good taste. I mean, I can taste some vegetables. Kind of. 
Hope that makes sense. Tastes like a salad. Isn't that weird? Mm hmm Right way to start the meal, I think. I mean, anything tastes good when you're hungry, right? Yeah. Black bean season. This is, hello, this is supposed to go inside here. <laughs> Black bean. You help a brother out. What did you put in there? We'll find out That's later. Well, maybe I put the wrong one? That fits, though. I think you need you need both, chili and bean. Chili and beans get mixed together. Yeah, those two. Maybe. Oops. Well, mine's really hot. You know, yours has two in it, so that's. Yeah, feels good. No, yeah. it's working. It's working. It's working. Moving on. Let me try some of the uh, cranberries. Oh, that's, that's a lot. <laughs> yeah, dried cranberries, huh? I like dried fruits. Are they fresh? Yeah, they are. Yeah. Sweet. Mmm, really sweet. Sweeter than my lemon lime drink. Not bad. Hmm. Okay. I'd say we got about five minutes left on these. We're gonna have to eat dessert first. Cheese filled pretzel. Well, I just had. <laughs> just had cheese. <laughs> I guess this this thing. This is the dessert. I think. Or wait, it's cornbread. Cornbread TFF. Hmm. By Sterling Foods. Hmm, really? Cornbread. I love cornbread. You like cornbread? Yeah. Fine, you can have half. You can have half. Cornbread. Here you go. Going in for some cornbread. really sweet. Tastes more like cake. Have you had cornbread before? I did. Hmm. It's different. Yeah, it's sweet. This is more moist. Yeah, it's more like a, yeah, like a cake. And it's good though. Definitely good. It's not tip, like typical cornbread though. Yeah. Well, I like that. It's nice and moist, not dry. Yeah. Mm. I'm done. Move in on. Moving on. Come on, open something. Let's go. What do you got? A moist towelette. I think I'm done. I don't have dessert. You didn't get a dessert? Yeah. What's up with that? <laughs> you got barbecue sauce, you got a cheese, oh, put put some cheese on a tortilla. Oh well, yes, right? Yeah. Yeah, do that. That'd be interesting. You can compare the, the vegetable crackers to the tortillas and see, see which goes better with cheese. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah, that's a good idea. <clears throat> They give you these little like sleeves. I'm not sure how you're supposed to use these. I suppose if you read the directions, maybe uh, it tells you. It tells you how many calories are in these. Each MRE contains between 1,200 and 1,300 calories. Hmm. Not bad. The average daily calorie requirement for males is between 2,800 and 3,600. So that would be like three of these MREs. 
you could eat in a day and be be fine. I got well, it's a lot of sugar though. Okay, so basically this is just the nutrition facts on printed on here. But I think this is also it's like a it's a utensil. So it's, it's you're gonna use this and put and use this and put it put it inside here. Yeah, it's a it's a it's a case. Right? I see. So when it comes out of there, you you put it, you load it into this little pouch. Okay. So basically, it's uh, it, it's so that, so that you don't burn yourself. Basically, you put it in there, and then you can scoop out. But yeah. All right. Let's, yeah. let's try that this time. Let's try it. I think we're just we just manned up and just you know went for it. Right? Yeah. But if you heat these up, like it, maybe if it's in there longer, like 20 or 30 minutes, it's gonna get super hot and you really need this. But we're pressed for time a little bit. So, yeah, getting close. Mine's really heating up, yours is so-so. So-so. On the bottom it's hot. It's getting there, it's getting there. This is, mine's way, way, way more hotter though. Go figure. Hmm. Oh, uh, because the heating element's in the middle of yours, and mine's just a, yeah, it's really interesting to, you know, to see if you put, yours has twice the amount of stuff in it. How are we coming along here? <laughs> Can you open this? Yeah. Yo. Thanks. When in doubt, use your teeth. All right, while you're working on that, I'm going to open up my cheese-filled pretzel Cheese filled pretzels. Cheese, cheese filled. Oh, these things. These things are the bomb. I love these things. I don't know what they're called, but I've seen them before. You guys seen these before? Cheese filled pretzels. Looks amazing. Show them what you're doing now. I got some cheese. Mm. You know what you might want to do? You could put the chili beans inside there too. Yeah. So, I think that, right? Yeah. You can make a tortilla, like a burrito. Why don't you save those for the beans? I'll okay? save it. Let's save them. Have some of these. Cheese flavored, cheese filled pretzel sticks. They're fresh. Yeah. I mean, this food lasts for five years, but it's not stale. I mean, it's, you know, soft. Pretzels are usually really hard, right? Yeah. These things, soft. And the cheese is good, and gooey. Yeah. Huh? Hmm. Not bad. Not bad, U.S. military. Got two drinks here. I got iced tea and I got Moogie Cha. Which would you like? Mugi cha. And this one's for me here. This is just for the for the pretzels. You gotta have this. Oh no, it's sweetened. Ah. Uh, this is like American tea. It's got sugar. Spice salt. <laughs> Shipaista, that's Japanese for. I made a mistake. Shipai, shita. Uh, but it's not too much sugar. Yeah. Mugi, the barley tea is much better. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so are we gonna get in on these main menu items? Are you ready? Yeah. I don't know if yours is ready yet. A few more pretzels? Yeah. Okay. A few more pretzels. Another minute or two, we'll be ready. Mm hmm. At least now that we got drinks, we can eat pretzels. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. These are amazing. Mm hmm. I don't know how they keep them so fresh. 
Magic. Mm-hmm. Magic. Speaking of magic, there's a new magic trick from Japan. Mm-hmm. By the Tenyo Magic Company. Mm-hmm. And over on his channel, he does magic tricks, right? Yeah. They're pretty fun. Little, like, one short, one-minute videos. Some good stuff over there. Yeah. I like the uh, the toilet paper roll trick. That's a good one. You guys should go check that out. Yeah. It's that, that I think that video is only like less than a minute. A good video. Yeah. I'll put a link to it right up over there. Yeah. And what should the people do? The people should subscribe. <laughs> you subscribe. Yeah. Why should they subscribe? <laughs> Why? Yeah. Why should they subscribe? Because I do magic tricks. You do magic tricks. Yeah. That's right. Cool magic tricks that you can't see anywhere else except in Japan, right? Yeah. Nobody else has got them. Yeah, that's the interesting thing. They're magic tricks designed and made in Japan. Mm-hmm. Japan only. Yeah. Cool. All right, let's get into these main... Main what? What do you call it? Main entrees. Does it feel... Does it feel hot enough? That's the question. It's kind of hard to tell. Okay, so out with the main entree. It's warm enough. Chili with beans. Chili with beans. Maybe I'm gonna put it inside one of the tortillas. Okay, and then yeah. the water, the, we're gonna heat up this cold water for coffee. You, and you should do the same. Yeah. 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 Yeah, see now there's plenty of room for this. Right, it fits, fits in there pretty nice, easy. Snug. Yeah. Okay. Let's hope it like that. Good stuff. All right. So here's the little pouch. I'm gonna use the pouch this time, just to keep things neat. See, like that. That's how it goes. See, and there you go. Labeled and everything. Chili with beans. Okay. but it, it opens from the side though. That's weird. No, it's okay, it works. Just kind of, kind of, sort of. Okay, well, it's kinda hard to keep it together. That's what it looks like. Chile with beans, actually, they actually look pretty good, I think. I think they look amazing, and they smell amazing. Okay, so first I'm gonna go in with just a spoon. Yeah. You all right, Darren? <laughs> yeah. Little taste test. And then we're gonna pour them onto a tortilla. And you've got barbecue sauce here as well too, huh? Yeah. Mmm. Mmm, tasty. Yeah. Tasty. Needs like crackers. I ate all the crackers. Yeah. What is yours? Show it to the camera there. Do you know what it is? That's what? It's barbecue. Shred beef and barbecue sauce. Mmm. There's the barbecue sauce. Do you put that on it? We'll try it without first. I'm pretty sure you're supposed to use the barbecue sauce. Yeah, it needs the barbecue sauce. It needs it? Yeah. Hmm. It looks more like beans. Shredded beef? Yeah. Okay. Hmm. So there's beef in here, there's beans. It's a bit on the sweet side. I mean, it could use a little kick. Spice. Almost like baby curry. Mm -hmm. The beef is good. Yeah, kidney beans. Mm hmm. It's got a good consistency. Meaning, you know, not too thick, not too watery. How's yours? There's some um, beef chunks. 
Beef chunks? Yeah. Did you pour this? You want to pour this inside? Yeah. Okay. All of it? Yeah. Okay. Barbecue sauce going in. Okay. Mix it up. See what happens. Perfection or failure? <laughs> or just meh. Sugared iced tea, never again. This is so rare in Japan. You know, normally when you buy tea out of a machine or wherever, it's un, it's unsweetened. This, disappointing. I should have read the label first. That's it though, it is refreshing. It's nice and cold. Okay, take two from the Mega. You feeling it? Getting your barbecue on? A little. A little. A little. Would it work better if it's in a tortilla? Yeah. Okay, let me try it in a tortilla here. Hit me. Oh, yeah. That's probably uh, more than enough. <laughs> Did you mix the barbecue sauce in there pretty well? Yeah. Okay, so here's what we got going now. Part two. I mean, it looks more like beans, but this is shredded beef with cheese and barbecue sauce. Does it roll? Can we roll it up? Oh, oh no, disaster. This is getting, this is getting messy quick. <laughs> Going in. Oh. Wow. Tangy. That's amazing. What else, what else you got going? Oh, the beans. Yeah. Beans. I don't know, it's supposed to be mixed together. Yeah. With that. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Oops. Speechless. It's kind of interesting. It's a lot of food. Yeah, some beans. Yeah, I think you got it right. He's mixing up. Yeah, this is a better one. It does need beans. This is just all goopy. Not bad. No, oh, good with the cheese. The cheese makes it. Would you rather have just like some rice? Like the onion get rice ball? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> or a hamburger. <laughs> or a bowl of noodles. <laughs> Oh boy. Well, <laughs> chili with beans was mine. Chili with beans. I like the chili actually. You want you want to try to get some of this? Yeah. So I put your spoon in there. And if it had some onions and some, I should have saved the crackers, right? We we blew the we used the crackers up in the beginning. Yeah. With crackers inside here, like you know, busted up. I think that would make it nice. Or pretzels. Yeah, here's an idea. The cheese-filled pretzels going in. That's gonna work. Yep, mix that up. There we go. Gourmet happening now. Mm-hmm. And it works. It works. Yeah. Oh. Meaty. Mm-hmm. Okay, moving along. 
to the accessories. It's time for coffee. I love how there's like chewing gum in here. That's great, right? Yeah. Save that for the end. Matches. Make fire. Dairy creamer. Salt, sugar. And look at this. Toilet paper. They think everything, don't they? Well, it's a napkin, but you could use it as toilet paper. Yeah. Well, yes, you could. Right? It's pretty nice. Yeah. Okay, so coffee? You gonna go for it? Yeah. Fine. Coffee. How am I gonna get that out? How, how do I get that out of my cup? <laughs> Use the toilet paper. Of course. When there's a will, there is a way. Clean that up. There we go. Clean cup club. Okay. You find the coffee instant type three freeze dried. It says add six ounces of hot or cold water. Hmm. Okay. Pouring in the hot water. Yeah, that's pretty hot. How's yours? Lukewarm. So so. So so. Mm -hmm. It'll work. Get this open. It's wet, it's tricky to. There it goes. Oh, yeah. Just the perfect amount. You have coffee? Yours is the same as mine? Mine's type 3, yours is type 3. Oh, so it's just instant. Yep. Yeah. It's a nice touch. It's good to finish with coffee. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, feels like we're out camping in the woods, doesn't it? Yeah. Where's the tent? Did you pitch the tent yet? <laughs> <laughs> Build a campfire. Got all the food. Yep. Yes, we do. Meals ready to eat and drink. Going in. Oh, you put the cream in yours, huh? Yeah. Hmm. <sighs> That's quite refreshing. <laughs> no aftertaste. This is good coffee. No. Oh. Not bad, U.S. military. Yeah, I like it. Mm-hmm. It's good stuff. Right up there with Starbucks. Yeah. <laughs> it is Starbucks. <laughs> I don't know what it is. It's U.S. military. Type 3, that's what it is. I like the coffee. The coffee is really nice. Last but not least, the gum. When somebody mentioned that these are a laxative. Means a laxative means they make you go to the bathroom. What? I don't know. I didn't have to go to the bathroom. I don't remember. It wasn't anytime soon. I. Didn't, it takes this stuff quite a while to digest. It's heavy. Mm-hmm. What? Mm. Mm. Good way to um, finish your meal. Fresh in your breath. Good flavor. Yeah. So, I think it's time to rate this meal. Meals ready to eat, number one. Menu number one. Menu number two. We got the first two. Once again, the uh, chili with beans and the beef shredded in barbecue sauce. Mm-hmm. Where are you gonna go? 
How are you gonna write yours? I'll give it three. Three, you're just giving it a meh. It's always a surprise how these are gonna taste. I'm gonna go, uh, I'm gonna go num num. I really enjoyed the pretzels. The pretzels were good. Those vegetable crackers were good. The main dish was even good too. If it had some chopped onions or the crackers, well, it works pretty good with the pretzels in it. Basically, you have to decide how you're gonna eat, how you're gonna mix and match the items, and I think that is the trick. If you mix and you match the items right, you're gonna have success. Yeah. And a good eating experience. But, of course, everything is based on these things, the heat, the heating element package, so this has gotta be, it's gotta be ready. It yeah. takes time, so. If you don't have much time, <clears throat> then you're gonna have to wait for this. But it's all good. It's all good. So that was the review of MREs, Manny Number One and Two. If you guys would like to see more of these, we're gonna do more of these because I've already bought them. <laughs> I'm gonna take my time. I, I think you, I can't eat these all the time, you know. And and we're gonna mix some other country ones in as well too, right? There's Japanese ones, and somebody mentioned the Russian ones are pretty easy to get and are really are good. So a lot of countries actually have these military rations and they're all different. So I'm very curious to try more of them. So that's gonna do it for this one, guys. Thanks for, for watching. And they should leave a comment down below if you can, because we read the comments. And definitely go check out Mega Branch's channel. He's the magic man. What's up, what's up, wasabi? Hey, congrats on making it all the way to the end screen. Care to hang around a bit more? Click on some of the links on the screen and watch a few more videos. Cheers and beers. Who's thirsty?